garbage. <laughs> All right, Seth, with number three. Uh, I'm your huckleberry. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. We we mean you know. Yeah. We know. We know who the better one was. Yeah, we do. Thank you. What? Yes. Yeah. The best one what? Really? Doc Holliday? Yeah. Are you talking about that Kevin Costner movie? Yeah, the better movie. The better movie. You mean the movie that was actually about Wyatt Earp, not just Earth. Tombstone? Yeah. If you say so. Do you even watch Wyatt Earp? Yeah. Then you didn't like it. I saw it in the theater. <laughs> you have a problem. You have this like this this, this uh, pattern going. Yeah, I don't think I, I don't think I'd be friends with you anymore. <laughs> That's acceptable. Oh, you did. <laughs> <laughs> what I do love, you do? I love yeah. Kevin Costner. I love him. Uh, again, he's another one that's either really good or really bad. Yeah, but fortunately enough, he's made more really good ones than really bad ones. Yeah, yeah, I would agree with that. The Untouchables. Oh my god, yeah. I love Great that movie. movie. That's yeah. a good movie. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Usually, anything he does, western wise. Like even Silverado, his part in Silverado was good. That was a good movie. People didn't like The Postman, but I liked The Postman. I love The Postman. I liked that movie. Yeah. I love that movie. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, even Waterworld wasn't as bad as everybody makes it sound like. I, I just couldn't do it. It was. I, I liked me, it. I tried, and I was like, God, this movie sucks. I tell you what, I don't like that everybody does like. Dan Dances with Wolves. Movies. Yeah, I, I didn't really. I like that one too. I didn't really like that movie. I like that's that. one of the ones that I didn't. Yeah, like. Yeah, I actually thought that one. That, or that was kind of a. My parents loved the movie Open Range. I I didn't I like seen it. it. I, I did not like that. That's him and Robert Duvall. Yes, that was pretty good. I yeah, mean, I didn't like. To that me, one that's two. That they're two similar type actors in your in your in your roles. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's like they're too similar. Did you ever see Hatfield McCoy's with him and uh, Bill Paxton? I didn't watch that. Yeah, I, I don't know if it's still on Netflix. That was really good. So wasn't that a miniseries? Yeah, yep, that was really good. Yeah, them two playing off each other. But yeah, the other Doc Holiday was better. Yeah, absolutely. He actually looked the part. Yeah, he did. And like he looked like he was dying. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he actually almost died for that role. Yeah, well, Heath Ledger did die for his role. <gasps> okay. After the fact, number three. Oh my! Who, number, who are you? You're, you, you, you. Okay, so this line, uh, before this line happens, uh, there's there's a big build up where uh -huh. this this woman uh, finds the man who murdered her uh, her family and sold her into slavery and and all this all this mean stuff. White supremacy. <laughs> no white supremacy. Is this Joan of Arc? No, it's not American <laughs> History X either. So don't ask. Okay. Uh, <laughs> He said white supremacy, so I was like, <laughs> yeah. bite the curb. But anyway, um, <laughs> that should be on my list. <laughs> no, um, so anyway, so she's going off about all these bad things that he did. And he responds, oh, oh my poor yeah. child, all these horrible things that happened to you. Yeah. But for me, it was just it was a Thursday. Yeah, I thought it was a Tuesday. It was a Thursday. I looked it up. Thursday, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I thought it was Tuesday forever, but it's yeah. Thursday. Thursday. Yeah. 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 Greatness. Yep. Street Fighter. Street Fighter. Roll yeah. Julia. Yeah. yeah. R.I.P. I saw that on uh, AMC or no, it was actually on HBO. Yeah. Yeah. It's like the best worst movie Gen ever made. Lee. Yeah. It was so stupid. Yeah. I'll have to, I'll have to watch so it bad. Again, Quick, I'm change the channel. <laughs> <laughs> it was so horrible. I can't believe they got some of the actors in there. Yeah. Like Gandhi was in that motherfucker. Are you kidding me? Yes, he Not was. the actual Gandhi, obviously, <laughs> but he was kind of dead by then. Yeah, a little bit. Uh, what the heck is this? What's going on here? Anyway, my number three. Yeah, man. My number. Th see, I had a hard, I had a difficult time with my. Uh, so I'm going to switch my, my number one and my number three. Your number one and your number three. Yeah. So when you're about to say is you really was your number one. Was my number one. Okay. Yeah, from Han Solo. Scruffy nerf herder. May the force be with you. Okay. People think that he was the first person to utter that line. Okay. Now here's what I was going to say. I'm glad yeah. you finally said that line. And here's what I was going to say. I will say. I personally believe. That's the greatest movie line of all time. Yeah. Because even if you take movies like I'll, yeah. or lines like I'll be back or frankly, right, right, right. you know, I don't, I, I don't give a damn. Um, some people know him. Sure. But like if I asked Princess Jasmine, I'll be back. What's that from? She had no fucking idea. Yeah, no clue. Yeah. If I said, may the force be with you, she knows that Star Wars. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Have to. Yeah. You know, same thing with like with Janet, right? Yeah. Yeah. And so I think anybody if, will know what made the force be with you. Is. Right. She'd better know it now. Yeah. I'm a diehard didn't, fan. Didn't you show, didn't you show him to, your, to her finally? What? Or, had she, or, had, or had she already seen him? Star Wars. Then you say that she hadn't seen him. And no, you were gonna... she's not seen him. So she still hasn't seen him. No. What do you? You're a horrible boyfriend. What are you doing? You need to start an order and show them all to her. It sucks, but it, you need to do it's, it. It's one because she's seen you know bits and pieces here and there. Uh, oh, yeah. It's like, um, do do you do them in numerical order or do you do them in? See, that's a hard. That is a hard question to ask because they tell you to skip one entirely. Well, it was so bad, and it has. But no you need it if you want the whole story. Yeah, uh, I mean, unfortunately. Yeah, but do you do? Do you really? Because you miss prequels? out. First of all, you missed out on Darth Maul. You that's miss out true. on Liam Neeson. The whole Qui Gon Jinn yeah. part is important because yeah. that's you know that's when they first find the boy. 
That's the and, reason why yeah. we have Darth Vader because Qui Gon Jinn's a fucking idiot. Yeah. <laughs> I'll teach this boy. My, yeah. my, this uh, what was it? Uh, there's a there was a like a meme or some shit. Yeah. On, meme. Yeah, a meme. A yeah. meme. <laughs> my my. Anyway, he's talking about instructions for when the aliens find our ruins. 400 years from now, how to watch the Star Wars films. Yeah. First, you have to watch episodes four, five, and six. Mm-hmm. Yep. Then you have to go back and watch one, two, and three. Yep. And then you have to watch the Clone Wars yep. TV show. Yep. <laughs> uh, the cartoon, that's great. Yeah. All out of whack. Honestly, right. I think you should start with Rogue One. I think that's where you should start. Oh, and then it's a, and then you got to go in and put in Rogue One. I think Rogue One should be where you start. I'm telling you, man. That was that fucking. It's going to be tough for them to outdo Rogue One. Yeah. See, I just got, once again, I got an argument with Rock. And uh, he's an idiot. Yeah, he well, he's like the only two good Star Wars was uh, A New Hope and Empire. That's it. Well, he's an idiot. Yeah, I, I don't agree with him. No, uh, I think Rogue One. I think Rogue One was actually better than Episode Eight. I absolutely, I agree. absolutely. And, uh, I liked Episode Eight, mind you. I think they should go. I told. I think I've said this before. I don't know if I said it on the show, but I think that they should go back and remake every single Star Wars using the exact same special effects as Rogue One because I think Rogue One is was. Like the, w- the way it looked was as perfect as Star Wars. It was really get. good. Yeah, it was really good. Everything looked good. Neil deGrasse Tyson didn't like the fact that the uh, the Tie Fighter sounded the same on planet as it did in space. He said that's not possible. Which he's right. It's true. It's not possible. But it's, it's, science. it's not possible. That's a movie. Still, I yeah. Mean, come on. I mean, did you Pew. see that the college humor one where it's the fucking it's no the Darth that Star Wars meets Star Trek? No, you gotta watch you that see shit. The sh- I, 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 <laughs> <laughs> Your special effects just, suck. Just yesterday, that's not the point. The, yes, guy, it is. the guy was this guy was walking into the mall, uh-huh. and he had a shirt that had the uh, "Live Long and Prosper" uh-huh. hand, right? Yeah. And underneath it said, "May the force, May be, the with force be with you." Yes. Yeah. And the first thing I thought of was, how many people are going to not realize that's a joke? Yeah. How many people are actually going to walk up to this one. guy and be like, "Hey, idiot, that's not right." Yeah. There's another one that has like Gandalf on it. Uh, oh, God, and he said, and it was it's some is a line from Harry Potter. <laughs> You're a wizard, Harry. <laughs> I think it was something like that, yeah. Uh, and then there's another one still that has like all four of them, just all kinds of jumble fucked. <laughs> that's, I need to get a shirt like that. Yeah, that's great. That's my type of sense of humor. Yep. All right, uh, number number two. Your number two? What was your three? My number three was May the Force Be With You. Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, my number two? Yep. Um, passenger 57. <laughs> Always bet on black. Always bet on black. <laughs> it's probably the most racist thing I've ever heard you say, Seth. White supremacy. <laughs> <laughs> Followed by the most racist thing you can say. Yes. Well, I don't know. I can think of some more. Well, I'm sure you can. Yeah, that's definitely not the most. Trust me. <laughs> All right, number two. What you got, Flair? <clears throat> yeah, but John, when the Pirates of the Caribbean broke down, <laughs> the Pirates didn't eat the tourists. <laughs> Jurassic Park. Yeah, no, that that one in. I'm fairly alarmed here. <laughs> <laughs> you ever know what that is? Uh, that's an impact tremor. Yeah, that's what it is. That's what it is. <laughs> I'm fairly alarmed here. <laughs> we gotta go. We must go now. <laughs> yes. We gotta go now. He used the same line in, in Independence Day. Day. Yeah, you must, must go, go faster, faster. Must go faster. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but I don't. I, you know, honestly, I think it was. I don't know which one was used better either. Uh, not because it it, it's, it's equal usage. Same, I know yeah. because you're running from something that will kill you. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> oops. What do you mean, oops? What do you mean, oops? That way. That way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I had heard no fat lady. I had heard no fat lady. What is your obsession with a fat lady? <laughs> Just drive. Um, <laughs> oh shit. Uh, hide. Hide. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was uh, that whole uh, just Jeff Goldblum and Will Smith that oh, yeah. entire scene of, of banter back and forth was yep. just perfect. Yep. My number two. Hi, <laughs> hi Seth. Yep. <laughs> I've enjoyed Independence Day. It was, yeah. Uh, second one. I'm hoping Independence Day isn't your number one. No. Okay. Thank God. <laughs> no, no, no. Thank God. Uh, let's see here. Oh, yeah. uh, okay. The, my, my number two. I'm just going to say one word. Mm-hmm. Jack. It better not be. I'm the king of the world. No. <laughs> no. Not that Jack. Different Jack. Uh, Ron Williams Jack? You, know, you don't know no. the truth. Or you can't handle the you truth. You can't handle you the can't truth. Handle no, the truth. but uh, yes, a very same actor. Different Tom Cruise? Movie. Different movie. No. <laughs> you can't handle the yeah, truth. Yeah, that's Jack Nicholson. Yeah. yeah. Got it. Different yep. movie. Yep. Different what movie. movie could he have? Oh. Um, Come on now. Um, oh, God. Here's, Here's Johnny. Johnny. Yeah. yeah, that had to be my number two because yeah. hey. I thought that should be your number one because that's your name too. Yeah, I thought so too. But Jack Torrance, yeah. Jack Torrance was the character yeah. from The Shining. Yeah. <sighs> Are you out of your fucking mind, <laughs> <laughs> Lloyd? <laughs> that's um, 
Yeah, that's probably that's probably one of the best one lines of the, that, and deliveries he's ever done. <laughs> oh man, when she walks in, there's a crazy lady in the house, and he just has that drunk look at him. Are you out of your fucking mind? <laughs> let, me, let me ask you something. You ever dance with the devil in the pale moonlight? <laughs> See you around, that's kid. That's the one I was trying See to think around, of. Kid. Yeah, yeah. I'm not joking here. <laughs> Uh, that was actually a line in one of my scripts. You remember that? Yes, I do. And it was the guy. I forgot the. I think uh, it was like Panther, and he was like an assassin or some the, shit. It was it the? It was the zombie. The second remake of the zombie film. No, right? it was it was the one with. Um, oh no! It was a Bob and Jimmy, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. And he was supposed to kill somebody. And he was like, "Yeah, you ever dance with Devil in the Pale yeah. Moonlight?" Yeah. And he's like, "That's Batman." And he's like, "I'm not, I'm not joking, joking here." <laughs> yeah. Oh, um, oh, my sense of humor. Yeah. But that was the first one. Yeah, yeah, I think it was the first one. Yeah. yeah. That sucks. We never did that. We can still do it. We should. I don't know if we can play the characters anymore. Yeah, we have We're to. We're getting older. That's okay. CG. But they're supposed to be like right out of high school, not going to college because they're losers. It's okay. We can make it work. No, we can't. Look yeah. at your beard. No one will believe you. Look <laughs> at my gray hair. No one will believe <laughs> me. Like, they make this thing called Just for Men. But I'm Apparently, a girl. Apparently, women can't use it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but women have a lot of stuff that has just women in the title, so <laughs> on you. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> All right. Uh, honorable mention time. What do you got there, Seth? Well, I had, you uh, go, go, go through your list, bro. I ain't got time to... <laughs> Bleed and you yeah. Oh, that's uh, it? That was Those it? were all my own. Oh, oh, Lord. What do you got there, player? Are you serious? <laughs> that's, yeah, actually, that's one of my <laughs> that own. Yeah. I am serious. <laughs> Don't, Don't call, call me Shirley. Shirley. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Dr. Stryker, by the way. That was his name. Uh, I also got uh, uh, The Power of Christ Compels You. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I've got uh, We Ain't Found Shit. shit. Yeah, that's so good. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you find anything? <laughs> I've got no, sir. <laughs> <laughs> How about you? We ain't found <laughs> shit. Hey, t- <laughs> they got hey, the hair picked. Hey, Timmy, fucked up. have you ever seen a grown man naked? <laughs> <laughs> You're Will Chamberlain. I don't no, know, kid. I don't know if this is. No, it's Kareem Abdul Jabbar. I don't know if this is your number one or not. I don't know if I want to say it. I'll say it afterwards. Okay. Because uh, it could be. Uh, and then I got. The, there's no crying in baseball. <laughs> <laughs> Are you crying? <laughs> that's such a. That's one of the best. That's one. Of, that's again. Tom Hanks at his best right yeah. there. That whole delivery. Yeah. Hey, Rarity, we've got a penis with a hat on. Rarity, we've got a penis with a hat on. Oh, you heard me wrong. <laughs> and, then fi- and then finally, uh, the one I added at the last minute was, oh, you're letting him blow right by you. Come on. Ninja kicked the damn rabbit. <laughs> oh, what the fuck was that? Ninja yeah. Turtles. Ninja Turtles, yeah. When, he's, when Michelangelo's watching the yeah. tortoise in the hair race. Yeah. Uh, let's see here. Uh, of course, I've got uh, the, damn it, man, I'm a doctor, not a insert whatever. Should have been, damn it, man, I'm a doctor, not a pool man. Not a pool man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Dr. McCoy from Star Trek, yeah. <laughs> And then, of course, uh, the, the one that I told you that I use all the time still to this day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All righty then. Yeah, yeah, all the time. Yeah. Like a glove. Yeah. That's what I do. Yeah. Bulby tuna. You know what? Hey, you know what I use? Like, I actually use And I don't use it just in the line. I use it, like, every day in speech when he does that. When they're like, the tutu shaman. And he's like, the what he wasn't. <laughs> I still do that today when people say something I don't understand. Yeah. I'm like, the what he wasn't. The what he wasn't. <laughs> yep. Yep. You do. All right. Uh, bowls. Hello. <laughs> Oh no, Guano! The whole Click cave, the whole, the whole cave scene. <laughs> I'm okay oh, yeah. as long as I have my torch. Die, devil bird! <laughs> Take <laughs> that, <laughs> you <laughs> winged spawn of Satan! Yeah. Oh man, I didn't particularly care for the second one. I like the second. Really, I like the second funny... one better. I like the second no, one better. I could, there was, f- was more funnier like one-liners in the second one than the first one. But to me, it was like they were trying to be. It was too over the top. How can I forget my favorite scene of all of Ace Ventura? What do you feed your dog? <laughs> He's miserable. <laughs> Why? So you could beat him, it's fatty. Funny. Yeah. <laughs> Why did you cry about it? Saddlebags. Saddle yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the All greatest right. scene. Yeah, that was pretty good. Of, uh, that was back when Courtney Cox was really coxable. Yeah. <laughs> Dickable. Uh, coxable, because her name. Yeah, I got it. Because yeah. her name's Cox. Number one, Seth. Oh yeah. Oh. No, you say what? One more goddamn time. Yeah. Sam Jackson. Wait a minute. I thought I had that one. Oh, yeah. I think you think you know that one. Here we go. English, motherfucker. Do you speak it? <laughs> That's it. There it is. Dude, you could just be like number one, Sam Jackson. Yep. Yep. No more motherfucking no, no snakes more motherfucking on snakes. this motherfucking, motherfucking plane. plane. I'm tired of all these motherfucking snakes. Yeah. So stupid. That was a bad movie. It was, but he made it better with that line. Yep. He and, made it, well, and the fact there was a snake that bit a girl in the nipple. That was pretty cool, nipple, too. Yeah. Yep. All right. Which number one? Dumb premise. It, well, you know how they got it, right? Internet poll. No, I'm serious. <clears throat> All right. Yeah, what you got? My number one. Yep. You never got the drum roll, did you? 
Psh, I tried to get one, but we had to pay for it. So I'm oh, okay. one. Yeah. The greatest trick the devil ever pulled was. Con